Hello, Shigar here, and we are on the Uncertain Last Quiet Day part number four. Uh, as you can see, we have our lovely Bella sitting here. She is very excited because it's treat time, and she gets a meat stick. She absolutely loves these things. You can just watch her eye it. If I wait too long, she'll drool. But let's let's give her some. <laughs> she she just inhales that thing. Absolutely loves it. Alright, now tell everybody, say, say goodbye to everybody. Alright, go. <laughs> oh, she's a sweetheart. Now she's probably going to go eat her other chew that she had yesterday, so let's go ahead and readjust my webcam. There we go. But yes, we are on part number four. We're about ready to get right into it. Uh, this is my Sunday, so you'll be getting this on Tuesday. Last we left off, I haven't played this game in two weeks because I ended up recording two hours. But I do remember I just entered uh, the facility that's supposed to be housing where the humans are going to be. Emergency burn. lighting. Apparently nobody has entered this lab for years. So, that being said, let's just go ahead and explore. Security turret. It is not operational probably due to the power feed disruption. If the security system is not disengaged, there might be problems. Okay, so my first goal will probably be to discard, uh, disable the security. Access denied. Hermetic sealing of the compartment is required. Right. Okay, let's go ahead and seal this. And while that's going, I'm going to grab me a drink. Access granted. So... Wonderful caffeinated beverage. That's just security room. The shatterproof glass. Laboratory equipment. The panel unlocks them. Access granted. Okay. This was where I ended up. Uh, stopping. Looks like the door is stuck. Better not touch it anymore. Food ration distributor. These rations are useless to me, but perhaps I would find some use. Use for the future, okay. Um... This door leads to the security room. Evidently, there are few such security points in the laboratory. Okay, let's go ahead and use my uh, laboratory rewards card. Power is not supplied. Check if the generators are working. Denied. It is not working. I do not know what is behind this door. Access 
Access denied. Of course. And let me guess, I have to check the generator. Power is not supplied. Check if the generators are working. Okay. So I can't access those two doors. I came from the right. Uh, so let's keep going forward. Error encountered during boot up sequence of the air filtration system. Okay, so no. Oh, what about you? Access granted. Cleaning in progress. Complete. Okay. A module for implant upgrades. It is suitable for humans only. All right. Let's check that. I would like to search everything here, but there is no time now. I had better do it after we transfer the humans. I do not know what is behind this door. I'm not going to bother with the hand touch because obviously it's just going to say um, access denied. Access granted. Okay. In we go. Obviously, this way. Hooray! Okay. Judging by the size of the generators, the research in this complex required huge amounts of energy. Making sure my dog's not barking. Let's see, 748, so I assume I start about 745. Generator control console. supposed to do this. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay, I get it. So that has to be straight. Okay, I like this puzzle. I definitely like this puzzle. Um... Same problem. 
problem. There we go. Power supply is restored. Initiating boot up of the laboratory systems. Ventilation system is non responsive. Water supply system is non responsive. Senior engineer must access the main console for troubleshooting. Judging by the size of the generators. Okay, let's see if this will open up. Yep, there we go. These turrets are active. I need to avoid their field of view, or they will destroy me. Okay. security robot. Apparently, it is not functional. Maybe I can use it as cover. How would I use it as cover? That's the question. Okay. okay. Well, I screwed up there. Some sort of... Okay, well, I could use this cover, but the question is how? Oh, does my doggy one in? Yeah, my doggy wants in. Come on in, doggy. Yeah, it's a good doggy. Okay. So the question is... How do I use that robot? I think that's the same thing I saw in that hospital. Okay. Commercial scale 3D printer. It allows us to print parts of any complexity from a super strong polymer. Using it, we can produce any spare parts. It will definitely be of use to us. What's that? 
judging by the number of workstations, a large group of scientists were engaged in scientific research in this laboratory. You don't say. This is the biggest computer of all the ones I've seen in the complex. Perhaps it is the main terminal of the laboratory. Laboratory! Let me guess. Access denied, right? Access denied. You are not authorized to access this terminal. What does my keycard say? Employee identification is confirmed. Security system console is unlocked. Who are you? I am Ivy. Interactive virtual interface. I connect the staff with lab systems, as well as take care of the research process safety. Disable security. What kind of research has you been know conducted what? in this lab? I am sorry, you are not authorized to access this information. Okay. Give me a report on all systems. Power supply amounts to 74%. Security systems are on. Danger. High level of SCR-CRW toxin in the air. Ventilation system malfunction. Manual reboot is required. The lab is not safe for humans until I find a way to reboot air ventilation and disable the turrets. Okay. This way. No signal. Although this place has been abandoned for many years, the equipment is intact and functional. Why did nobody come back to collect it? Maybe the people that knew about it died. Okay, so just pointless button pushing. There are various vials and flasks, but all the fridges are empty. What were they researching here? I'm pretty sure it might be behind. Umbrella Corp may be behind this. They're making viruses. That almost looks like the portal gun right there. I'm pretty sure that has to be a tribute to the portal gun. Because we saw walking uh, Clementine's hat from The Walking Dead. I wouldn't be surprised if there's other tributes here. Bioscanners. Great. We will be able to scan and treat the sick here. Take a screenshot of that. Yep. Probably helps the keyboard's on. There we go. Judging by the number of Okay, I already heard that before. This three D Yeah, I already heard that before too. And I guess I can't go there. So the question is, how do I disable a security system? Do I have to run back? power stores. In case of the generator's failure, their capacity would be enough to supply energy to the main laboratory systems of the laboratory for a few days. These emergency power sources are extremely rare and valuable, but I cannot move them because my chassis will not withstand the high physical stress. 
Well, okay then. Bella. Bella. Enough. I already looked at you, looked at you, looked at you. Looked at the bio scanner. Okay. I guess I gotta run past the death turrets again. about those things, so whatever. Um food rash. These rash. You say the same thing there. Uh what about here? Now that power's restored. Access granted. Ah, security. The turrets are not a threat to us anymore. Good. Reboot the ventilation system. It is a code lock. I cannot open it. Well, look at it anyway. It is a code lock. Bella, enough. Thank you. Yesterday, there was another accident with toxins in the laboratory chamber. Another one. This is the third case this month already. Your staff ignores safety instructions. Have a safety briefing, find the culprits, and do something. Otherwise, we'll have to reduce our financing. Do you know how much it does cost to hospitalize the staff? In a week's time, I want your full and detailed report of all the measures you've implemented to stop this from happening again. Well, the first thing we did was disable GLaDOS so she wasn't uh, venting in uh, deadly neurotoxin. I'm pretty sure this entire thing was kind of inspired by Portal. Access granted. Cleaning in progress. Yeah, whatever. Cleaning complete. Ventilation system. I need to activate it in order to make the air in the laboratory safe for humans. Air recirculation system is operational. Expected filtering time, 1 hour, 12 minutes. I must head off to the meeting point as soon as possible. Okay. RT. Do not return 
to the hospital. I repeat, do not return to the hospital. We are urgently evacuating. Several police aero cars are approaching us right now. We managed to hijack a shuttle and Fletcher used it to pick up humans from the city depot. Go there and warn them. Somehow the police found out about our plans. I will contact you later. The message was sent half an hour ago. The police could have set a trap in the depot. I must reboot the engines to get there as soon as possible. I guess that is the end of the Uncertain Last Quiet Day. No wonder uh, YouTube lists it as Chapter 1. Very interesting. Um, it does seem to come off with a uh, Life is Strange type of vibe, but from a robot standpoint. So I can understand if it's multi-chapter like that, and with that in mind. So I guess we will wait and see what uh, the next game has to offer. Uh, next week we will start up something different. I'll figure out from the list. Uh, typically I stick with games that take less than 10 hours to play. Uh, so a lot of games that Perfilion has given me will probably end up on this list. Um, some of them are more than 10 hours, but those he has spent more um, funds on actually giving to me. Uh, but that's besides the point. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this series. Uh, this was a rather quick game. Um, well, at least quick video for today, so we will, once I get an idea of what the next game is, how much it is, when it's being released, I guess we will go from there. But if you have any questions or anything, Feel free to leave it in the comments below. And we will let the game uh, go through its credits, as I usually do.
Okay, so that was that. Uh, but yeah, we will call it here uh, since I completed the game. So with that being said, this is Shigar signing off. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I will see you tomorrow. So please stay safe, take care of yourselves, and I will see you tomorrow. So goodbye for now.